interesting in NTU. There are many stores and services that are popular to the students. However, in contrast, there are still some stores that would not be recommended by most of the students in NTU, especially the following two. Oh, the first, the first one is the buffet in the first student activity center, uh, which is called Huo Da Zi Du Chan in Chinese. The other one is the barber shop in NTU, which is located across from Xiao Xiao Fu. Uh, one day, a strange idea came up to my mind. Why not making an attempt to visit these two stores and experience their service by, uh, by myself. Therefore, the following story is about a, great, a, a brave adventurer who is not afraid of death and his battles over these two difficulties. Thing. Uh, the first challenge is uh, the buffet in the first student activity center. Uh, before my first visit, uh, I was trying to realize how other people comment about this store. So I, I went to the PTT and tried to find some comments. So here's the comments. Uh, I, I'll read the words, so don't worry. The first one is, Huo Da Zi Chan is really not edible. And the second one is, there's a snail in the dish. <laughs> so the, the comment is so negative. So uh, before, before my visit, I, I want to encourage myself. As a real adventurer, you are not supposed to care about the quality of food. And then I pull up my courage walk into the buffet and order some food for my dinner. Unfortunately, after my first bite, I felt a little bit regretful. The meal, the, the meal was so greasy and, and it was so salty for me. And the environment uh, was really not hygiene, hygienic. Uh, However, I just think that the food is just okay. It's not that bad as those who criticize this store. I just think that it is not delicious. However, I was so I was too optimistic then. Because the moment I arrived my home, I suffered a severe stomach ache and I dashed to the bathroom as soon as I can. That tragic night, I spent totally for more than three hours there. <laughs> so, I made up my mind. I would not, uh, I would never visit the buffet again. So this is the, my first challenge about NTU. So, it's complete. <laughs> the second challenge is about the, bar, uh, the barber shop, which is located across, uh, across from Xiao Xiao. Uh, on a sunny Saturday, I was going to have uh, afternoon tea with my friend Benny. But however, before we met, I suddenly found out that my hair was too long. If I choose to go to the barber shop in my neighborhood, it will take me too much time on the traffic. So. I decided to get my new haircut in NTU. However, when I arrived, I found a strange thing. All the customers are the elderly. I didn't see any student there. So, uh, so, I still have to find another way to cheer myself up. 
<laughs> As a real adventurer, you are not supposed to care about your haircut. And then I pulled up my courage again and stepped into the barber shop. A kind-hearted woman led me to my seat and she started to shave my hair. Uh, during the process, actually, uh, we had a very nice talk. Uh, we talked about a lot of things about NTU. But suddenly, she asked a question that is very difficult for me to reply. Her question is, Hey boy, all the customers to the barber shop are the elderly. Why don't the students in NTU come? <laughs> so I suddenly, I was suddenly in silence and I, I was trying to figure out a, a proper reply. But before 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 it came before I came up the answer, the haircut was already done. <laughs> <laughs> to my surprise, it only took me for less than fifteen minutes to finish it. So, but the most important is how do I look? So I met Benny and we had a nice afternoon tea. During the process, I, I asked him the question, how do I look? <laughs> then, the Benny was in the silence, which is the same as what I did to the hair stylist. <laughs> and the moment, I finally realized that it's over. <laughs> 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 Finally, no. these two challenges are both complete. Yeah, but to uh, to my uh, although the process was not always smooth, but I learned a lot from it. You can take other people's advice into consider, but you will miss a lot of things if you are not willing to give a try. So next time. Try to experience by your own and you will learn a lot from it. Hear me.